The Bible says, Every knee shall bow, and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Amen. You know, Caiaphas, Anna, Annas, uh, Pilate, uh, the people that smote him with the fist, the Roman soldiers that had him crucified, and you and me, every one of us shall bow the knee and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. The only thing is if you get saved before you die, if you get saved and trust Jesus Christ as your Savior, and you bow the knee and say, Jesus Christ, you're Lord, and I give my heart to you, and you get saved, you won't have to bow the knee in the next life. Then you say, oh, I'm not going to bow the knee. There's nobody going to bend my knee. There will be somebody that will bend your knee. I promise you, you in all humility will bow down and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. And that unfortunately, because of your stubborn, rebellious ways, you will be cast into the lake of fire forever and ever. And so, uh, you say, what do you think is the best plan? I, I'll tell you what I think the best plan is. I give up all my pride. I'd give up everything that I've got. I'd give up what anybody thought about me. I wouldn't care what anybody wanted. I would seek to trust Jesus Christ as my Savior, whatever it took. Yeah. And, uh, uh, say, say, Pastor, who do you think saved? I'm, I'm telling you, you need to know that you're saved. You need to know that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior because He is. He is Lord. The question is, is He your Savior?